Hello everyone, welcome to Jehu Crochet and more. In today's video, I have a yarn review for you. And today's yarn is very unique. I have not come across anything like this before. This yarn is 100% fiber made out of corn. It is called mice and it is produced by the company Pasquale. I will tell you a little bit more about the company itself later on, but I wanted to focus about this yarn. Just think of it, it is 100% organic fiber made out of corn, and as such, it is 100% eco-friendly yarn. You can already see the corn on the tag. So as I've mentioned, this yarn is made of 100% polylactide that is that mite cellulose that is the fiber made out of corn it is made in Portugal there are 50 grams per ball that's 110 meters that's about 120 yards the recommended hook size is three and a half millimeters and you need about 500 grams of this yarn to make a size small or medium sweater you can machine wash it up to 30 degrees Celsius. This one is color number 131 and the color name is Lemon Sherbet. This one is color number 129 and it is called Clementine. And this one is color number 127 and it is called pumpkin orange. These are the three colors I chose and I chose them because I think they complement each other and go well together and with those 150 grams that I have here I think I can make a nice project. The yarn itself is thin. I would say that it is somewhere between a sport weight and a lightweight three leaning towards the sport weight. The yarn itself is soft. It has a little bit of a cottony feel. If you ever worked with mercerized cotton, this is about the same feel of yarn. It is sleek. I have a feeling that this will just slide on the hooks. It has this like really nice finish to the yarn when you feel it with your fingers. It's very nice to the touch. And I think these will make beautiful summery items. I can really see something flowing. Because of the feel of the yarn, I have a personal feeling before I even tried it that it's going to drape very nicely. So I'm gonna get my hook out and we're gonna make ourselves a little batch. I worked out a small batch just to see what it feels like to work with this yarn and also to show you how it comes up. I made just two rows of single crochet and then two rows of double crochet. And I used the recommended hook size as mentioned on the tag. So this is a three and a half millimeter hook. Working with this yarn is a dream. It really flies off on my needles. It is very soft. It is elastic. I think it will be great for children's items. You get a very nice stitch definition with it. And in some ways it reminds me a little bit of working with cotton yarn. Although it feels a lot nicer in my opinion great stitch definition. You could definitely use a smaller hook. I would personally categorize it as a sport weight now after working with it. I think if you'll go down a hook size or two then you'll have less spacing in between the stitches but a three and a half millimeter still works nicely and this will make a beautiful summer shawl or bathing suit cover and I think it will make beautiful children's items because it is so soft. Um, it is airy, it is breathing material, it will keep moisture away from the body, 
it is elastic it has a movement to it and i think the qualities of the fiber itself are very suitable for people who are asthmatics who are allergenics in different ways and one thing i would say is that you need to be careful when you're working with it that you don't put your hook through the yarn itself because as you can maybe see here the yarn itself tend to split that's just the way it's spun it's nothing bad but you do have to watch it when you work with it that you don't accidentally put your hook through the yarn itself now just to show you let's do a little bit of frogging so i'm gonna just pull on one end and as you can see that works wonderfully no problems at all in my opinion the only downside for this specific yarn is maybe the amount that you get in each separate ball when i hold it in my hands you can already see how small it looks even though it is 50 grams and there are 110 meters per ball the amount that you get is not a lot I can't really think of one item that I can make with just one of those balls. I will always have to get a few of them. And that is maybe the only downside I can see to that yarn. Other than that, I only see pluses. And that is something that I just had to share with you guys. Um, I want to talk a little bit about the company, Pasquale. They are situated in Germany. Now, I did not know this when I bought the yarn and I was pleasantly surprised to find out that they're actually not that far away from me. Their home base is actually just half an hour drive from where I live and I might even come across them in an upcoming trade show that I'm going to so there is something to look forward to. I've already been in contact with their customer service because I wanted to make sure that they do ship worldwide. So if you go to their website, first of all, I recommend that you check out all of their yarns. They have a very large selection of yarns. Each one of them comes in a very large selection of colors. And if you like to dye yarn yourself at home, they have a whole collection of bare yarns that you can dye. And this is something I like a lot. Go on the website, check out the different kind of yarns they have, check out this yarn, it has a lot more colors available, and if you want to order, they do ship worldwide. However, if you find that a little bit complicated, if you find that the shipping might be a little too expensive, I'm not sure, I did not check how much shipping costs in every single country but I do know that shipping within Europe is very reasonable I also think that the shipment costs to the US are reasonable but you know prices is a very individual very subjective kind of thing so each of us have a different opinion of what's expensive and what's inexpensive so I highly recommend that you check it out yourself and if you do find that it might be a little bit too expensive for you then the good thing about this company is that they are available on Amazon. I'm not sure that all of their collection is available on Amazon, but some of it definitely is. At least within the European Union, I cannot check other countries. I know that this specific yarn is available on Amazon. But I do believe that if they work with Amazon, they already have their whole collection on there. And I will also link a third website I found which hold Pasquale yarn, not this specific yarn sadly, but others from their collection. And I will link that in the description box below too. So you will have three different options in the description box below to where you can get yarns from this company. And I really, really recommend it. You go to the home web page first. Even if you don't end up ordering from the home page, I do want you to check out all the beautiful selection that they have. It is just amazing. I mean, I'm so happy that I found this company. I found them completely by chance because I was looking for sustainable and organic materials and just complete happy accident as they call it that i came across them and now i'm hooked 
So I hope you found this review useful. I hope that I shared new information with you and that it interests you. And I would love to hear in the comments what you think. I would love to hear if you ever worked with this kind of yarn before, because really, I did not even know such a thing exists. And let me know in the comment section also what you think I should make with these three, because when I ordered them, I really had nothing in mind. And now I have a thousand different ideas. So thank you all very, very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!